we are in the lab. Tuesday, August 13th, 2024. What I got here is mocha hete. It's clean. I kept I keep it in a bag. I got an actual one of those uh refrigerator bags. So what we got here is a little bit of fresh oregano. This is from my buddy Frank next door. Frank, hi man here. Look at this, it's really good stuff. Fresh, really. So what I'm gonna do is mocha hete this up. Oh, did I not say I'm making... I'll probably put that in the title. You know what I'm doing here. I did this before. I'm going to put a little bit of spice in there. Oregano won't hurt anything. It won't hurt any uh, thing we want to make in the future if we want to put salsa or whatever. It'll be fine. Okay, now we're going to take our dried... These some baguettes here, baguette bread. And uh, they got... Ooh, wow, that really does smell good. They got a little dried up, so we're just going to... This is actually probably going to be a lot faster than trying to do it with the um, the hand blender in a in a jar. Wow, look at that. That is pretty quick. Okay, so we just keep throwing these in there, smashing those up. Yeah, this works like a little hammer. I like stuff I can make with a rock. And you can sift these. You don't have to grind and grind and grind. You can, sit, you can put them in a blender and make them as fine as you want. You can make this stuff back into flour, probably. That'll be another video. But, yeah, basically uh, breadcrumbs are just like dried up bread smashed into crumbs. You don't have to buy breadcrumbs. Just take your stale bread. Don't let it get moldy, of course. It can dry out. Keep it in the refrigerator. Not too long. I mean, if you want it kind of fresh. And then just smash this stuff up and strain it through a strainer. I've got a few different strainers. So there you go. Breadcrumbs cut. Oh, an Italian breadcrumbs because it's got oregano in there. And I got other Italian spices here. I could probably put... This has got some like fennel and stuff in here. So if you really wanted to go crazy. And then you put a little bit of Parmesan cheese in there too. But I'm basically going to smash all these up. Strain them out. Sift them. And uh, get a whole bunch of uh, breadcrumbs. Cut.